Yes, we're back, boys! Yes. The meatball's here! He really is the main man. The meatball. By the way, we learned. By the way, what do you know what? Actually, it means I were one of the guys. They had the stinking, by the way. Stinking ass. But you're hooked on that point. Is that brownie, mate? <laughs> Pull it in your horn. No, listen, I mean, we were really excited, really upset after the last performance for the man, weren't we? We what? felt we. Half hearted. Half hearted ways. I was ill. We didn't want to do no, oh, no. hey, 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 hey. hey. it. I was ill. We've seen you two years later, you were on a fucking show, by the way. Well, We've seen Brazil. you. It's because I'm professional. And you're going wild with Alan Brazil. I was professional, mate. You're I was ill. Alan Brazil's ass. <laughs> Come on, mate. You know I love doing it with you. Are you hey, by the way, the best you ever. look trim. Don't you? Very trim. You look like a new man. Sexy, don't I? Jenkins, Jenkins looking good or just better? Could you? No, know? he looks better. Yeah. <laughs> he's still I mean, just look, yeah, from, from when I first saw you to what you are now, you've it. come a long way. <laughs> end of season awards. Have you ever had a player of the year end of season awards? Do Spurs ever get player of the year at coaching? Have you won the bench um, all the time? Uh, Wolves, not hopeless there. No, I've got, I got player of the season at uh, Portsmouth. Eight, eight uh, player of the season awards. Eight? Eight. Yeah. So was that players, player, manager? Yeah, players, manager, man. What band know, did you like the best? Dad's got... player and mum's player of the season. Yeah. yeah, I got a few, mate. Yeah, and then uh, what did I get? Young player of the season at Tottenham. That was all right. Fucking hell. That was quite an achievement, to be fair. And then... Um, Who were you up against? Then I got shittiest player at Wolves by a million miles. Aye. Shittiest yeah, player of the season. Like you're very poor that season. Any, what thinking. about you? I go to first Celtic, aye. <laughs> Eighth season. Yeah. Yeah. Point, where, is it one what was this for? What, the, uh, under 18s? No, first team. Young player. I go, was that eight? He, he, I never know if he's being no, serious or not. Fuck, he was hopeless at Celtic. <laughs> hopeless, <laughs> mate. You oh, must have. Uh, so Decanio, uh, uh, de, de, yeah, here we go. Decanio. De 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 it took four minutes. <laughs> four minutes for a Decanio <laughs> story. <laughs> here we go. Come on. Come on. Get it out. No, there go, come on. Go on, if you like it. Oh, Paolo! 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 Have you found him there? I'm going for Decanio on the boys, mate. 100%. No, but talking about end of season awards. No name the player, but we knew a guy who was getting an end of the season award, so he was fucking buzzing. He was only a young lad at the time, he was getting young player of the year. Came on loan for a Premier League team, absolutely buzzing. So I went up to him just before he was going to go up for the awards, and Johnny, out the rapper, unravelled it, and I went, listen pal, you're going to think you're going to get player of the year. Oh, fucking buzzing for you. Mate, that's... Johnny hanging over his shoulder. <laughs> up on, up up on the stage, he's quite to his award, mate. That's unbelievable. <laughs> <laughs> Right, so we're going to do an end the season awards and we're going to start off a match of the season. Any, what springs to mind straight away? Man United's best performance this season. Everything Rangers. Unbelievable. What a team. Paul? Well, what, what performance in, what, what performance what, 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 Dortmund, Leipzig. Who's, I who, mean, have who's, to argue. Excuse me, who's to do it? Celtic. Turned his over, didn't they? Don't they beat them. Did they beat Celtic? Didn't they? No, no. Semi-final. Um, no, nah, look, come on. Let's be real. Key Scottish football, a bit of credit, but I will bar you. Yeah. Right no. here, right now. Oh, uh, yeah? <laughs> Rangers, what they've done this season, unbelievable. To beat Dortmund, to beat Leipzig, with the fact that they haven't got the backing of the Premier League teams, to go and do what they've done is absolutely the most unbelievable thing this season. Man United's best performance this season must be the 4 0 defeat to Brighton. What a result for them to only get beat four. That is, that's up there well, for Man United. How bad is it? Man United are just... Holy just, fuck, just, how bad are they? Disgusting. I mean, he can play for them. Huh? Him and McTominay in midfield. Seriously. <laughs> Get him out there. I mean, you'd... Bad start for you. We done Kim Watmore. We done Kim Watmore's getting a move to Man United. I start for the both of you, by the way. I don't like this at all. It's, a, it's an attack. Wait, what's your match of the season then? I'm surprised you never said that the best match I've seen in 10 years was Man City at the Etihad against Jamaica. Yeah. That was fuck out of this world, that football you played. So that was no, but so who, who's, who's performance? Real Madrid's performance or just the game in Man general? City. Just the game. You're going just I'm match. Going for the, I'm You're going match. Go no, the first, the first leg member. All oh, right, the first four, leg. Right? Four three it was. Yeah, but Real Madrid should never been in a tie. No, they were out. They were dead and buried. They were completely gone. But they absolutely folded, didn't they? I mean, absolutely folded. Would you give Pep any blame for that? In fact, he took De Bruyne. I think he, oh, took he, three over, best he absolutely overpepped it, didn't he? Yeah. I mean, typical Pep. Tries to be clever, takes off his best players, and Real Madrid scored two goals. Mm, I disagree. Come but, on, mate. No, because Jack Grealish, I mean, gets one clever out of line. That goes in the subs of a, a masterclass. We didn't go in. I know, but it didn't, it it didn't go in, though, did it? Yeah. And he took, he, he took off Mares, he took off De Bruyne, took off Jesus. What was surprising about that? He had a stinker. Obviously, it went extra time, but then he was stuck in with the players he's put on. With foot guys like De Bruyne, do you know what I mean? Yeah. So he's kind of went a bit negative there, I think. That's what I mean. And you, you're never out of it with Real Madrid. Look at them this season. They're the, they're the worst. Best team ever. How they at that position? But how are they in the final? Because yeah, yeah. you look at them and go, every team really is battered them. PSG battered them. I've seen you. Man City battered them. I've seen you doing a few of the, the, the matches and 
at the stadium. Liverpool, I seen you there. Who was Matt Lawrence, wasn't it? Matt Lawrence, eh? Mark, How was he? Big Lauren. How was he? He was, he was horny. <laughs> he, was, he does uh, look like the horniest guy of all time, doesn't he? He's a legend, isn't he? Let's nah, just say nah, that. Nah, he is a legend. Five times. So have you spoke to the managers or anything? Yeah, I was interviewing Klopp, Conte. Yeah. I asked him who Slaney was, he didn't have a fucking clue. Who <laughs> was. It's, only that, it's only the Dutch managers that know you, didn't it? After Amsterdam. <laughs> Do you, know so, that whole, do you know the whole Dutch high press we don't stop thing came, came from me, his performance in the red light is it I need to get this on YouTube <laughs> was it on YouTube no, it's, it's not on YouTube Paul Pump, you'll get it on right <laughs> <laughs> any other matches what else have we got here Spurs 3 Man City 2 your team that's some Spurs up that's just it? standard though isn't it we yeah. always turn over Man City it's then like you get we'll, beat for Dagenham next it, week. Yeah. You get beat by Brentford. <laughs> no, I don't think so. No, I think Conte's took you to a different team. And that was uh, me, Gary Neville, saying, man, you should t- touch Conte. And the guy's the best pundit in that country. Do you know what I mean? So. Mm. What about Bristol Rovers? 7-0. I mean, that's dodging it. That's dodging it. That's not right. Dodging it. Dodging it. Not right. I mean, yeah, right. You've seen that. I've seen that loads of times in the other leagues, have you? It's poor, though, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah. Last game of the season, playing kids. Joey Barton goes to win 7-0. No, that's not right. Something needs to be looked into, isn't it? Yeah. What about that? your best performance this season? Just in general. Last weekend it was a cracker. In the, in the, up in the bedroom? Ah, it was a cracker I put in. <laughs> it was really good. How long were you on for? Two minutes. Two minutes? Cracking two minutes, so. Two minutes. Cracking two minutes. Who was your bed. math? <laughs> <laughs> Do you know he's got a bathroom that's not got a window in it? What do you mean? He's only got one. It's like a dungeon. <laughs> so it's basically a dungeon. So if somebody does Has a he got like a swing? Has he got like a swing and everything? And... <laughs> We've got a swing, no, but if, as I said, we, we, we're fine. Why do you have a bathroom with no windows in it? Just to so how do you get rid of all like the shit? Like <laughs> the air? We don't be all going to do that. We all going to do that, bought it. He doesn't know you do that, didn't you? Do that. You all love it. My dad's done it and we all blocked my dad's. <laughs> His dad, his dad just goes, sits in the bathroom like that, doesn't he? <laughs> He's not, you know his dad walks about Glasgow with a big rucksack on every day? Why? Just get his pants in it. <laughs> <laughs> nah, nah. I need to meet your family. Oh, oh, you would you? Do you want to come up with him? Meet them for 10 minutes, we're only 10 minutes on the road. Yeah, I'll do it, let's do it. He's just going to stand. She, do you want to do a wee uh, plank off? Is your mum? Yes, yeah, come on, plank, plank off. Steady fuck about Let's see how fit you are. Steady talking dog shit. Is he going to accept the challenge or is he going to sit and talk shit? No, 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 come on, what are we doing? A plank. A plank off? Who can hold a plank longest? Where's the best club in the world? Best club in the world. What, ring girl? That's what you're going to be. That's it. That is, oh, hey, that's what you're going to end up getting. You're going to be brought in just to walk around with that aren't you, in the ground. Eh? Yeah, what I'm like, yeah. Rap it, rap here he thong, is, turn up, 150 on. quid a week. Brown thong. Bring him in. Brown thong on. <laughs> you want that people? What's that? I'm your, not doing that in your belly. Belly. <laughs> What's that? What you stuff in you, your belly? You look fit. You look fit. <laughs> right, you taking them on or no? You're pushing it. Well, I'll, I'll lose, but if right, you want to yes, do it, I'll do it. I mean, Scotland v England, Paul. Do not let us down. Big Eck versus Alex McLeish versus. Hold on, I mean. <laughs> uh, Gary Mason. How have I, have I got lumbered into this? Look, he's been training. I could have done this when I first met you. Jenky looks like Gary Megson. I mean, that's. Harsh on Megson, isn't it? Yeah, it's harsh, doesn't it? It's a bit harsh on <laughs> right, that. Go on. Right. He looks like a Blank skinny off. Shrek. <laughs> <laughs> Shrek on Herboy. <laughs> you want to get it done? Come on. Right, wait, are you, you going to do it properly? Like, Aye. Right. Arsten, chin up. Oh, no. He's oh, in our sock. Is he man up? One, yeah. two, yeah. three, go. How long have we got to hold it for? Look at my watch. What's that what fake d- one? What is that? 12 quid. What is that? Do you win one of them claw? <laughs> Jay, how's his breath? Do you brush your teeth for your arse today? How bad you do that arse in the jeans at? Nah, come on. Wait, look, look. Get your standard, right? Uh, so it's to be I fair, so I think your stance is going. I'm struggling. Yeah, yeah, I'm breathing. That's 37 seconds. I can do right, this all right, day, we'll go on to the next one. Best manager, who are you saying? Um, Eddie Howe, nah? Dean Smith. Edward Howe. <laughs> You're like Dean Smith as well. You're shaking. Hold on, are you alright, mate? Dean Smith. Are you alright? Are you okay? Dean Smith. Do you want to stop? Roy Hodgson. We can stop, stop if you want. Do you know you're right? 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 Oh, yeah! 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 Oh, you're a loser. Come on, well, I can do this all day. Yeah! 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 Fucking sign me up. I might be fat, but I can move, boys. Oi, arm wrestle. No, I'm not. no come on, one arm wrestle. Next one. No, <laughs> Wait, we're talking about manager of the season and arm wrestle. 
I've not got that in me. So who are you giving it to Dean Smith? Dean Smith, I Done think. Done great job at Norwich, Dean isn't he? Well, how well did he do? Dean well? Smith, <laughs> brilliant. <laughs> Manager of the year, Dean Smith. Or Roy Hall. No, Nuno. Nuno, I suppose. Nuno was good at Spurs. Nuno, what a draw, mate. Unbelievable. He got Manager of the Month and got sacked. <laughs> what about the German Solskjaer, we Ralph? <laughs> he oh, is the German Solskjaer. Can we have a minute? Can we have a minute? Oh, <laughs> Hey, I'm quite impressed, actually. Don't build it, you, you're a shrug. You've been in a boxing, haven't you? You can do all this training. It's all about core. It's all about core. Uh -huh. They move about agility. Have you been doing setups now, Paul? Uh -huh. It's part of your fitness comeback. Uh -huh. I've had a pull as well. What setups? Yeah. Who's standing a bit? When you come up, who's standing there again? <laughs> <laughs> Who do you get to stand right in front of you when you come back up? Uh, do I think he's somebody brilliant? I can't think of him. Roy Hodgson. Roy Hodgson, who's doing <laughs> As part of his training. So Roy holds your feet and you holds his feet, aye. Oh, Van Bronckhurst. Manager season. I just Giovanni. Well, how did he know when the league? Giovanni Van Bronckhurst. Unbelievable. A 12 point, 12 Hold points. Hold you, on, you, you're, you're asking me to give credit to I'd, Scottish football and I'm giving Van Bronckhurst no, but what manager I'm, of the season. What I'm going to say to you is and float back in your court is Stephen Gerrard got Rangers six points ahead of Celtic. He left, Van Bronckhurst came in. Right. Six points were ahead. And there are six yeah, but he's done something that Gerard couldn't do. He's got into a Europa League final. It's Get unbelievable. Out, beat what Dortmund, saying? beat Leipzig. Right, so what are you saying? What's your argument, Paul? Come on. Give me an argument. What sits in Celtic's door for him? Si? Tom Boyd's ass. <laughs> mate, what about, how's Posta Coglu on there? Mate, he's a joke. Come on, He's mate. unbelievable, seriously. Surely this guy's got it to be in for it, though. <laughs> Bitch dingle for Emma I mean, do you remember when we put them shirts on? We're all coming no. back to remember the camera Do you remember? Guy? It was horrible shirts. They remember were. the camera guy? <laughs> remember his performance that day? Um, uh, it's like Grove in a sporter day and uh, people get re released for jail trying to get them a job, innit? <laughs> or like clean the casino or something. <laughs> with an ass. <laughs> clean the casino with an ass. <laughs> He's come out from a five year stretch. Do you know what? Do you know what? Hey, hey, shove your shop your ass. <laughs> I'm out. Look at that. What's happened there? You're like, oh, mate. Right, who are we getting manager of the season? You going Van Bronckhurst? I need to go with Dean Smudger. I really do. <laughs> Smudge. I need to do it. I think you get a better buzz out of that. Can't go into all my Rooney. What about Rooney? Oh, you can really get it. You can't imagine you're getting really right, good, A lot of people like what he's done. I don't know, I don't know about you, right? Everyone's buzzing off about the wee speeches he gives. I always find it quite awkward the way he talks, nah? I'm never buzzing off at you. I've, but I've always been awkward with gaffers, haven't you? you no, know, but like, I'm saying, I, I feel like he's a wee bit, doesn't really know what he's you know, saying. You know, like when you do, like I keep saying, like Scott Parker done one, they playing it on Sky. Oh, SD mate, I was cringing, man. And he's like, it's, 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 like, it's like a miniature Harry Redknapp, doesn't it? <laughs> I was cringing for that. Like, like, you, know, like, you know, as a player, right, when you've been in a dressing room and all you're thinking about is getting down the pub after the game, innit? We've got, yeah. look, gaffer, come on, we've got a table book <laughs> in Liberties, in London. Out get it out so we can fucking get out of here, right? And you're sitting there all the <laughs> Like, yeah, yeah Gaffer, come on, come on, Gaffer. And all of you are thinking, fuck off, shut up, shut up, shut up, fuck's sake, just let me go and play with you. <laughs> so, so who, who's like, getting, who begin to manage it there then? Ancelotti. I think oh, we're in the Champions League. What, what do you mean, if? No, it's the same, you're, you're, no, you're you're argue, it's it's the same argument with Van Bronck. Oh, we're giving it now, I'll go... Eddie Howe. They haven't won a fucking trophy. I know, but they were going to go, they were going to do it, weren't they? <laughs> First manager when you've been in the bottom three at Christmas to keep, is that right? I've seen that on Twitter today. Oh, you got that. You got, got that stats, Twitter stats, stats, I got the stats, mate. I, I'm going Eddie Howe. Yeah, I'll, I'll, look, for me, Van Bronckhurst. I would need to manage. And it's just got to be. Followed by Dean Smith. I would say he's Dean won Smith. the league. How many managers? 52 times you've won it. It's no, nothing, he's won a double. Nothing new. Won a double. Nothing new. Won a double. Won a double. No, it's, it's nothing new. They were like 15 points behind last season. It don't matter. Well, and it's a new season. There's players left. Ooh. Edward, Edward, Palace, I am. Trust it, Bournemouth. I am who went and done well down south. Come on, come on, come on, mate. What? It's 52 <laughs> times you've won. Yeah, let's give it to Scott Parker. Have you, get, have you got Scott Parker's number? No. Bastard, love to prank you. Yeah. You need to watch that, mate. It's good. Uh, right, we're on kit of the season. Do you, you know my favourite? Is it one of these? The Broomhill one. Oh, have you seen the new Broomhill kit? The... Are you going to come up and watch a game? Mate, I'll million percent be there, mate. We'll take you When's your first game? There's going to be hospitality. I'll come pre season. You sort me out, I'm there. Would you, would you come and take part in pre season? Yeah, of course I will. Just, we'll to, so, just training, so I can show guys what happens when you really when don't you, look when after When you let yourself, yourself go. <laughs> <laughs> I'd show still play in your team. I'm just playing your team. I'd get in your team. Sit on the three. Mate, just get me in the middle. <laughs> Jan Mulby, just bopping it about. Just get some runners around me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You might not. You've gone black. Black's good. Slimming. 
Yeah, yeah. So get me a, a double XL. How do you think? Oh, where's no, the That's bulky. That's the That's bulky. Oh, that's your kit. Is that the. Uh, uh, have no, you got the Let's see this one. This is Vintage. Jamie Carragher's house, look. Sorry. That's the grandma. Right, that's. Yeah, it's Carragher. Wait, you saying, son? He's out with a Liverpool child. Wait, you saying, son? And he's cat, isn't it? Name, 69. 69. Selene, 69. That's a nice kit, that. It's good, isn't it? Yeah. Show me the way, man, son. We've got a picture, yours, we've got a picture of you in it. Oh, he's but getting, all, he's getting all serious now, isn't he? He's getting all fucking serious. Like, sit down, sit down. All right, sit Gaffer. Down, sit down, Gaffer. Sit down, Gaffer. Fucking hell, he's changed, hasn't he? He's changed. That's how he kits him. Is it Dortmund? <laughs> Dortmund, we've gone Dortmund style here. Fucking hell. Nice, eh? Yeah, mate. Looks all right. The only thing is you see your tits in it, like yeah, quite Mate, tight. listen, everyone loves a pair of tits, don't they? <laughs> you could be the ring girl with me. They're like, ah, they're involved with you. What colour is his? Me and you sent them in, surely we'd be bothered. What colour is his stock? Listen, you're going I'll to take... What are we going to have? <laughs> pink. Pink. <laughs> no, you put me in some stupid kit. And a pink whistle, whistle, pink whistle, pink thong. I'll come and ref a game pre-season. <laughs> uh, right, any other kits that you've liked? Munich. I like the Munich away kit. Arsenal's, uh, Arsenal's kit, man. I tell you, there's no rival there with Spurs and Arsenal. Spurs are away kit. Come on, that's that's unreal. What kit that is? What colour? The best away kit. What colour? It's the mix, isn't it? Like blue, yellow, bit of orange, black. Do you know what's unbelievable? Do you know what's terrible, by the way? The Puma kits. Too tight. No, but see, if you see them, it just says Man City there. It's not got a badge written. Yeah. Horrendous, isn't it? The Man City one, yeah, that was bad. It looks like something you'd wear on a night out. Signing of the season. Surely it's Grove now signing up and goal because we fucking took your bum ass to a new level. Aye. We've carried you the full season. Hell, mate. If it we... wasn't for me and that podcast, you never would have sold out the fucking Hydro or whatever the fuck it's called. I think that was sold out uh, six months before we met you, maybe. No, I'm no joke. How many people were there? 25 or something? What was I it? You, set, you set a record of no joke on YouTube for the lowest <laughs> views in history. <laughs> <laughs> that did bring a big boys in. Oh, I loved it. Big Fair in, play to your boys. It's fucking different class. Who else? Tammy Abraham. Abraham. I thought Lukaku was great. Okay. I mean, look, Eddie Howe. <laughs> Eddie Howe's not a bad shout. We're talking he's signing a season, stupid. Well, he's a fucking signing. He, they signed him. No, we've done manager. We're talking about player. No, he's there. He's on the list. Who's put Eddie Howe on that? Dickhead. Look, he's there. Whoever's put Eddie on there is getting sacked. No, that's a good shout. He said Eddie Howe used to him a minute ago for that. Yeah. Because that's to be manager of the season, but signing of the season. Well, he's still a manager. Diaz, oh, Luis Diaz. Ah, he's a joke. He's, he's taking it over to put another level, isn't he? Right, go on, give us a name. <laughs> Who are we going? Ramsdale. Nah, can I go him? Nah, nah. It's got nah. to be Luis Diaz. He's actually, Liverpool are going to do something this year. He's affected that. Every other signing, their team's not going to do Luis anything. Diaz, probably, yeah. because if they win the treble and he comes in and he come in in January, it's a great signing and just mm -hmm. backed up the squad, didn't it? And took him to another level where you're not thinking. If it ain't Mane, Jota and Salah, who are they bringing on? Now it's like, right, we've got Diaz, we can mix it up. Diaz takes that all day. Yeah. He's Diaz is, yeah. Guy, isn't it? yeah, and I just love his energy. His energy, he just gets it. You know, yeah. I think you play for Liverpool, you've got to get it. Like Klopp gets it. You know, Henderson gets it. And you, the players there, I think Diaz has come in and he just gets what the club's about. Why don't you come and have a pre-season down south? Yeah, we'll put you in the bottom. You get a team together, we'll, I bet you'll St. George's fucking doing it, St. George's. I will go, I'll organise a team, right? stadium, bring your team down, we'll have a game. 100%. Yeah? Yeah, end of June. And I'll get a fucking decent side. Get a team. <laughs> no, these boys are good. Boys good player. Yeah. But I'll, so there you go, we'll, we'll see what the level is. You get a team, as good a team as you can get, we'll come and play you. We'll right, have a wager I'll sort it out. All right. 100%. Who's right? the first manager in your head to know you could get? Roy Hodgson. Instantly. Yeah. Roy Hodgson, fullback. James Collins, Danny Murphy. I'd love to do that. Mark Wright. Right. I'll get, 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 get them together, mate. Right? I'll get the... Oh, mate, I'll put a team together. Right, you do that. We run over the top of you, mate. 100%. We ask him about his, his management. No, 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 it's, no, it's, no, no, it's not a time for that. It's not a time for that. No, 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 come on, come on, come on. Don't go and gaffer on me. Come on, what's the philosophy? What's the philosophy of... Oh, what's it? 4-4-2. Four, four, boom, 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 <laughs> just fucking boss, lad. Oh. Trying to mix up. Get it as far away from your goal as possible. Are you bag. trying to play? No, Scott Parker, mate. It's going down the Scott Parker. Come on, lads. Come on, lads. Let's play, lads. Yeah. Right, social media. Social media mop out the season now. I've seen a pundit doing a TikTok dance. A guy that wants to be taken seriously in the media. Don't know what you're talking about. It's dancing. Don't know what you're talking up. about. What are you... Right, so talk us through when you're asked what... What's your thoughts when you first because of your Well, you act like a dick in the TikTok dance. What, what was your response? Look, lads, I'm, you know, I'm all, I come and work with yous, which is like the lowest of the low, really, isn't it? I this mean, so I'm doing a TikTok dance. 
<laughs> so awkward as well, like you mean, man? I mean, I don't have TikTok. And even my son phoned me and was like, Dad, what are you doing? Your, your son's like, ah, you're a loser. Yeah, but Dad, he was like, like, what, what are you doing? Sees. I don't know, it's worse to Dan, so the fact that he's wearing trainers with a waistcoat. What are you talking about? That's banging out of it. Yeah, he's got shoes on my son there. You look brilliant now. David you know, I took a lot of stick for that. A load of stick, especially from my missus. Did you? Yeah, she was What did she say? I can see what she was like, what are you doing? She knows doing? your game. She knows your game, Alec. She knows what you're doing. Nah, nah, you know, just being professional, right? You've just got to be a nice guy and, you know, you get asked to do things, have a laugh with them. I need the math, I do, I need the math, it's, I'm sitting here getting annoyed. What, 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 what do you want? You want to swap watches? Do you want to feel like what it feels like to have a decent watch on this? I need the drizzles after Can you swap watches just for the can rest of the, the show? Can please? Come on, let's do it. Come on, so let's see what he looks like with a Rolex. Careful, it's heavy, yeah. He's the only guy that can make a Rolex look shit. Mate, look at this. <laughs> Fuck is that? Phil Pink, hold, hold on, hold on. A curious? What is that? <laughs> a curious? Be careful, mate. A curious. Do you know one day we were on this podcast, right? And his phone was sitting. Did we make the last for that? Mate, <laughs> a, as small your wrists was it a child? So only how it's, what is this? Like tell, tell, as we might. I mean, come on, that's pathetic. <laughs> <laughs> it smells alright. Smells like a Peroni, doesn't it? Just put it on. Can you click it? Oh fucking hell! You can tell he's never had a Rolex nah, car. Like, Jesus he's Christ, done. mate. Why don't you get a wee like? Have you, have you, have you, have you, have you, now he looks the bollocks. Here's right. a wee walk quick. Here's a wee walk. Can I? That me. Fucking hell. See, look, look. See, like, it's a man's wrist that though. Yeah, look yeah, look yeah, at yeah. the space in there and everything. I'd love that. I mean, what the fuck is this? How can you walk around Glasgow in this? Mate? Yeah, do come you know? Do you know when they. Yeah. Yeah. Come on, look at the gaffer. Look. The gaffer's up to his game. He looks the bollocks. Get him rolling. He bends a little. Hope he buys all the coats he's at. I watch. A gift will be a gift. Mate. What? what? A couple of vacuums. <laughs> <laughs> what would be 36? Well, 36, 36 quid in the pocket. Again. We don't like it. Don't feel comfortable with that. Well, because it's too expensive. No, I know it's expensive. We're talking about it. Come on, right, mate. Take then. it. And slap your ass on. <laughs> 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 you can buy it and slap your ass. <laughs> What's your screensaver on your phone now? Do you know once we went like that time, just caught him completely off guard, shows your screensaver, mate, and it was him and his bird holding hands, looking out in a, a, like a, a lake or something? No, it wasn't. Well, that's not your screensaver. Show me what it is. What is it? And he had what to change it because we. Spaceman. <laughs> fucking hell. What is that? Wait, We've got a picture of the moon. No, it's a spaceman on the moon, but do you know what he's actually doing? I couldn't fit it in. He's thinking I'd be on the moon. And that's my perfect one to do. Uh, uh, that's my perfect thing I want to do. <laughs> Die on the moon. You want to die on the moon? Aye. Jesus Christ. I want to die on the moon. Yeah. Uh, right, social but media muppet of the season. Yeah. So Kurt Zuma, John Terry. Kurt Zuma's got to take it anyway. What is he fucking thinking? Kurt Zuma. I don't like what I mean. that. Disgusting. Yeah. Disgusting. Complete idiot. Hold on, hold on. Oli going to Solskjaer leaving video. <laughs> oh my God. That club is fucked, that. <laughs> what is, what is that? Like, mate, you left. You got sacked because you were shite. <laughs> shite. <laughs> right? You were absolutely useless. You brought in Ronaldo, Sancho and Varane. And made an arson. And it absolutely fucked it up. And you want to do a leaving video, like yeah. crying and all that. Fuck off, man. Get out of here. <laughs> what are you doing? See, if you'd been sacked and something, the club kept me making a video leaving video. Yeah, yeah. No I'll be chance, like, man. where's my fucking check? <laughs> See you later. <laughs> Get me out of this hellhole. You take me Ralph's glasses off him before you left, right? Oh, so you couldn't see you on the side. Oh, and my you God. Jump off, you? I mean, but but then, get a pink I mean Man United, right, really and truthfully, Man United should just be the joke of everything on here. They should they? fall to Man United. Ralph Rangnick, the imposter, comes in. It's like <laughs> it's like Slaney's dressed up and going to manage Man United, isn't it? <laughs> Put a pair of glasses on. <laughs> right, Fletch. Right, right, Fletch. Cross the line with that one. Cross the line. <laughs> Would you agree to what it Man United to have? You're a big. I love Man United. Good at a Man United fan. So do I. We saw Alex, obviously. Yeah, of course. I love Man United. No, that's what I'm saying. It's a shambles now. Eh? Embarrassing. Man United. What's your favourite oh, Sir, Sir Alex quote? Wait, do you? What's your favourite Sir Alex quote? Fucking passing was fucking scratchy. <laughs> you heard that? No. Did you? No. Do you think we were talking about that? We didn't he coach that enough, Fergie? No, he's my manager, right? How do you think he'd do up against like a pep or a clock? It's it, he would he was still win. Did yeah. he? Well, he's come up okay, he come up against Arsenal Wenger. Come on. Yeah. He talked so about philosophies. Mourinho, he was Mourinho, the first yeah, yeah. one, Mourinho, he come up against them. Wenger was the pep of that time, wasn't he? But and, he and he got under their skin, better. he knew how to do it. He was great for me, the greatest manager of all time. Sorry, Alex Ferguson, he was yeah. calling him a fraud at lunch yesterday. I'm just no, no, not at all. No, he wasn't. No, no, I was thinking but it was a somebody actually read an unbelievable stat. I did an article every morning when I wake up. Right. Telegraph. And a guy said, what happened with Fergie in the two Champions League finals, Pep? Can you get a kick? 
And he got a touch he's he's best, he's playing against the best team that I've yeah, ever was, seen. That was the best team. Best team. Best team. Best Ronaldo, Rooney, Tevez. Tevez. Come, come on. on, mate. It wasn't that, though. He'd come up against the best team probably anyone's seen, ever. But So were they the best team because of Pep or because of the players? No, it's because they had Lionel Messi in the team. Well, we had Lionel Messi after Pep left and they never went out of the day what they'd done under Pep. Yes! Good night. Plan Get back up to no, London. No, I'm not, I'm not saying Early it's not plane, unbelievable. Book him a fight. Um, book no, him a fight. Good Guardiola. Oh. Even come out and said, I won the Champions League because I had Lionel Messi. I mean, that's he's sarcastic. modest, isn't he? That's it's why he's a top manager. He's sarcastic. Well, he ain't won it. How many times has he won it since? <clears throat> How many times has he won it since? How many times has Barca won it since? Um, I don't know. Get your fucking stats out. <laughs> well, I'm stat man over here. <laughs> Gaffer. <laughs> He's going to get his fucking clipboard out and everything. <laughs> clipboard. <laughs> yeah, lads, you are. It's important to have stats, but you also You go open. there, you go there. I'm going to pass it out to this centre back here and we're going to fucking boom it. <laughs> <laughs> See if you can hit the fucking crossbar. <laughs> uh, right, biggest letdown of the season. You must be up there a couple of times. Tell me biggest letdown? 100%. What do you mean? Oh, what? Oh, right, as in terms of players, well, we've right? We've kind of done okay, that, didn't right. we? Said Sancho has been a massive letdown as well, aren't you? Mm, expecting I think longer. he's been poorly he's managed. Been, he's getting three hundred fifty grand a week. He's oh, been poorly right. managed. Lukaku, Deli Ali. I mean, he needs to sort his life out, doesn't he? I mean, Why do you know so him? Uh, Jamie, do you know him? No, I don't know him. I don't you heard know. Heard any? What's happened to him? Well, he, you know, I think the issue he had was he went out of Tottenham, got to resurrect his career at Everton, and. I mean, look, I'm only hearing what I'm hearing. He, he could have moved to Liverpool, got his head down and tried to get in the team and concentrate on his football because everyone knows that's what he needs to do. He's moved to the city of Manchester, which is unbelievable, mm -hmm. probably better than London, and he's rolling around in a Rolls Royce. No, I haven't done that. Come on, mate. Right. See, do you remember the argument when McCoy in Brazil said they won the shoes? The same as, like, what's his name? Ramsey, isn't it? Up here, rolling around in a Lamborghini. Is he? Yeah, giving it a big one, right? No, mm. You can't do that. You know? You've got to, have, you've got to humble yourself. What more did you have at Spurs? Bentley. Mike Keller. <laughs> <laughs> no, but when, no, no, when I went to Wolves, I just bought I bought Range Rover, right? Nice car, smart, but not like Flash. Yeah. You go in and have a little bit of humbleness. I think Deli Ali's gone in at Everton and he's like, you know, he's driving around Liverpool, which is a completely different area to mm -hmm. London. And you just yeah. look like a class. Like, like, class. Yeah, they don't yeah, like yeah. all that, no. you know? Like they come from, you know, you sort of, Normal, people, yeah, yeah, like normal backgrounds, and you're driving around in a Rolls Royce Phantom, giving the ball away at the weekend <laughs> for fun. They're yeah. gonna be like, fuck off. Mm -hmm. uh, right, strangest moment. Bristol Rovers, we've said 7 0 promotion. <sighs> What's this about? I mean, I heard this earlier. Mark McGee. McGee. He's turned down his radio as well. And he said he was, <clears throat> he's gonna be freezing his house. Why? He's not gonna eat. He's no, not, he wasn't gonna eat. And he's gonna sit naked. He's gonna sit. No, he was gonna get naked if they won, the, if they won a game. Right, so... He what? said he was trying something different to the players so trying, to change Yeah, because he wanted to feel cold <clears throat> so he knew what the players were going through. Well, he, just, so he turned off his radiators. It was just bizarre, it was And then he went on a crash diet for his mind or something. I mean, what a load of old bollocks. You know, he was slaying his manager at one point. At mother, at mother was he? Mm -hmm. What's he like? Slaying he used to go in the bathroom. Because he was away. He was at Millwall, right? He'd done all right at Millwall. Was he? Was he all right at Millwall? He'd done all right at Millwall. Who else was he? Bristol Rovers, don't you? Brighton manager as well. Done well at Brighton. Back in the day, he done well at Did they win? That game, did they win? No, they got beat. Oh my god. They're sat, they're doing, they're really good. They're gone. They're really good. They no just, way. Is yeah. there Charlie Adams in that team? Yeah, yeah. So Charlie Adams got relegated yeah. in Scotland. <laughs> oh my god. So you're, the fans have oh actually started. Did you see his dive as well? I was yeah, like, yeah, fucking yeah. pathetic. Are you What's in Charlie Matane now? Yeah, I like Chaz, yeah. I speak to him quite a bit. Yeah. I didn't know he got relegated though. <laughs> Let's get him on the blower. Uh, hey, go for him. Go for him. Ask him what Mark McGee looks like naked. Oh, fuck, I don't know if I've got his number. Deleted it, haven't you? Oh, I have. Right, Charlie Adam. Charlie Adam No. Who's the most famous person on that phone? Um, Hodgson. Hodgson. Charlie Adam No. Let's see if he answers. Right. Put it on my loudspeaker. Oh, oh, he's passing oh, me. He's, he's fucking blocked your number. He's blocked me. Oh, he's no. blocked me. What's this one? This might be his missus. It has not been possible. <laughs> 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 what about the protester? Try to uh, tie himself to the goal by the neck. What's that you've usually got around your neck? Actually, yeah, I mean, I mean you're used I to stuff around your neck. I thought it was you, to be honest. You know, instantly when I thought, I thought, is that Slaney with a wig on? Saturday night, said you a bit, but <laughs> Saturday night out, man, and it's standard. Just tying yourself to a fucking to pole somewhere. Neck. He's went, uh, why do you think Christie's the best, isn't it? Rooney and Vardy. I mean, Since was an ex prem player, what would happen if that was as you were missing that situation? What well, are you saying? I mean, it just, it's embarrassing, right? <sighs> it's just embarrassing. You think Vardy and Rooney are talking to each other behind the scenes saying, what about these two? 
Oh, I, I don't know. I mean, I don't know how pally they are, or but I mean, they've played with each other for England, right? So yeah. surely they'd be like, fuck, you know, what's going on? But I, I guess you've got to protect your missus, haven't you? You've got to back your missus all the way. But I will be, you, you know, they're sat in that, court, in that courtroom just looking at each other going, fuck, you know, nice. Yeah. So do? Are, are you about your missus? No chance. <laughs> well, you <laughs> go with the opposite. <laughs> Fucking hell. Some you got to back your missus, mate. Who are you picking? Even yeah. if you don't agree. Who do you like I, I, I like the Rennies. I love the Rennies as a family, but Vardy's... How would you love about them as a family? Don't know, don't they have. And they same proper, don't they have family, Rennies? You ever met them? Yeah, yeah, I really like Rebecca, actually. I think she's lovely. Rebecca she's a nice Rooney. girl. So is that your sister? <laughs> he said the Rennies, not the Vardy's. No, you said Vardy. No, I didn't. I know, I the Rennies. Do you like the, he's saying, do you like the I mean, race? I like them all. I mean, who gives a shit? Do you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> seriously, who cares? No one gives a fuck. Snitches, yeah, you, you always knew who the snitches were, weren't you? Do you have skids? Do you think? I had a manager pull me in and say, go and find out what somebody done at the weekend. And I was like, go and fucking find it for yourself. Do you think, really? Uh -huh. So a manager asked you? I asked you well, well, no, what was he up to at the weekend? A certain player, and I was like, I'm going to ask him. You never had that, now, a manager asking about their boys? We used to have a snitch at Faces nightclub. So all the boys used to go there, Tottenham boys, back in the day, Faces. You know, you, you know Faces, right? Yeah, yeah. So it was an unbelievable nightclub and we were flying, but we all lived in Essex and Faces was the place to be. And after the games on a Saturday, the whole team would we'd have a table there every, every Saturday. Harry Redknapp had a, a guy on the door. It was like a family member and he'd have a guy on the door. And we'd never, we didn't know this for ages. No, every yeah. single Monday, we'd come into training, Harry Redknapp would go, Good night, Saturday. Good night, Saturday. In the end, you're like, fucking hell, lads. Who's fucking Amazing stitching exactly. us up? We found out from the owner in the end that he had, he had someone on the door. So every time he walked in, the geezer's writing it down saying, O'Hara, Lennon, Huddleston. The problem was it was fucking the whole team, so he couldn't drop us all. Is that good or bad for a manager doing that? I think you've got to you know, let the boys go out and enjoy, enjoy themselves. themselves. As long as it's no, if you've got a midweek game, I would say no. Yeah, no, we were out fucking regardless. No, Where else is good? Do you go to China Whites? I went there a couple China Whites back in the day. Um, what a gaff that was. So would you just go a, would, would you feel it would be a Sunday all day sesh? So we would go out, yeah, Saturday night straight after Saturday. the game, stay in London all day Sunday, back to training on Monday. Did you just do that at Talk Sport and quit? Uh, no, I've got a bit, I'm too old now, mate. I can't oh, yeah. be asked. Nah, I don't know. So I mean, you bought a red in the house, innit? Like a bottle of red, a a house, of red in the house, you know, a bit of Whispering Angel Magnum. What happened with boxing? Got cancelled. Why? Because I was too fat. No, it was it? <laughs> no, no. Why did I get cancelled? Uh, look, I don't know, but got cancelled. Bad mouth from, go bad mouth from. I was up for it. I was ready to fight. Mm -hmm. I fucking asked to fight you, you little bottle job. You go to fucking Hydro. You fucking bottled you fight it. Fucking you fight Hydro. Hydro. I fucking bottled it. You go to the Hydro and fight. I'll fucking fight you at the Hydro. Hydro. I'll just sing you... your plank. Yeah, I'll 100% fight we'll you at the Hydro. Fight the Hydro, 100%. Set it up, 20,000. Oh, yes. What's it hold? What's we'll it hold? Do, we'll do like a press conference tonight as well. We'll do we'll a lot, mate. Like, I want 50 grand. Gloves are off. Grand. 50 grand. Instead of gloves are off, trousers are off. Trousers are off. You need to set with the trousers off. Right, 100%. You need to set with the trousers off. Come on, let's do it fucking now. Let's set it up. No, no, let's just set up. We got the fucking Oh, Why don't you sit like Johnny Nelson? Right. Johnny Nelson. <laughs> I mean, you've not changed. What have you done there? Right. I know. Why don't you sit there? <laughs> now right. you've just killed I've yourself. Made it worse. You've made right. it worse. So, are you ready? First question. So, what's the beef here? Well, there's a beef right there. <laughs> <laughs> Right, most notable <laughs> bandit. <laughs> Selena, you're one, you're one at the hydro. Got to be an, have, you seen, have you seen my head at the hydro? Have I seen what? I see you coming out spraying shit over everyone. What was all that? Was it champagne? So and all that? It looked fucking great. Fair Thank play you. to you, boys. He shaved, he shaved his, he shaved his nut what the right down the middle. Oh my god, what are you doing? Like an old I guy. mean, it's actually an improvement. <laughs> It's guy, weird, yeah. but it's an improvement. <laughs> you know, what is that John, is you, John, you, you must have got paid to wear that shirt. Someone paid I you to wear that. I bought him that shirt. He bought me that. A present for the gaffer. Well, it was for Banner, right? Well, oh. You fucking wore that. I in front of all them people. He's looking well, isn't he? Fucking hell. Is that an old guy? It does look good, lads, I have to say. Fair would places. you come up to him, man? Of course I fucking would. Mate, we need to do that boxing thing at the Hydro. That'd be no, no, yeah, that'd be good, Banner. 500 quid? I want 50 grand, though. No, it's 50 grand. We'll get you 500 quid for it. I'll give, I'll give, I'll, I'll sort Sai out. Right. I'd love to iron you out on camera. Oh, any there. other, any other... <laughs> I'm just sparking it. How would you go about it? Would you go to fight or would you go to run? Run. 
and then go for every, five seconds every. Mate, the weight difference is going to be a problem for him now, isn't it? Do you know what I mean? I'm heavier than him, I'm quicker than him, I'm more agile, I've got better core. We did, I'll set up for the press. We need the press conference done. Where would we do that? We would have one in Glasgow. Would you? Land in London. Josh Taylor could maybe watch you. Did you watch the Josh Taylor fight the last one? Um, remember at the Hydro? Can't remember. Jack Catrow. Who could, who, who could we get to help? You're blue by the way. You oh yeah, Josh Taylor got better, didn't he? But he won. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Eubank could help you. You can have Eubank coaching, you can have Josh Taylor. I don't know, I'll just get the big guns in. I'll get Fury in or something. Do you know him? Well, yeah, he's one of the boys, well, Any other bad hair? <sighs> His pubes. <laughs> I mean, so that's grown back from when you've obviously shaved it Take off. Me. How long did that take? By Ages. And it still looks horrendous. <laughs> <laughs> Look at your hair, you Amazing. <laughs> 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 We've got Pogba. I don't know who's got the worst hair. Pogba. Pogba. I mean, fuck me. Come on, mate. Rob Holden got that back. Rob Holden got the transfer. Oh, mate, he looks well. Yeah, he looks well. <laughs> Fair play to him. <laughs> Any other hair? The wee guy that got Brighton playing there. We got scored left back. Cucurella. Big curly hair. Horrendous. Cucurella. Dean Smith's got one of the worst. No, who's the lad that comes on for Man United? Who's the young lad that comes on for Man United? I never found one to dig him out. Oh no, he's evolving on the Liverpool players. Yeah. Yeah. Who was that? Hannibal. Yeah, Hannibal. What is he doing? Come on, lad. You, you're a young boy. He's 17, 18 years of age. Like, just shave your hair off. Yeah, yeah. And just go out there and be a little pit bull. See, if you had like a fancy hair on that, would red red that pull you up, young boys? Um, Martin O'Neill said he pulled me up for my hair. I mean, you like that? That was a bit of a broad story, that. And then John Robertson told us to get my hair cut in front of the whole dressing room, and Henry Larson came and said, "No, nah, if that's who you are with your hair, don't listen to him. You can hear him, mate." Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. He's like, "No, nah, don't do not get that cut. If that's what you want. If that's who you want to be, then be it." But I had Martin O'Neill was like, get that haircut. Was yeah. Redknapp the same? No, Redknapp was quite chilled. Real, Redknapp didn't really care. I mean, Redknapp was just, do what you want, lads. When he was like, yeah. do what you want, just turn up and, and win. Mm. Just get the ball to Gareth Bale. I'm crouchy. <laughs> what about you? Have you ever been slotted through your pins? Not at all. I always looked up top ship. <laughs> I had some bad haircuts, by the way. Chesterfield. I had a shocking haircut. What is he coming to get us up? I had a mullet, like full on mullet. Mullet's mullet. coming back. back. You'd have, you'd have like suited, it was horrible. Give yeah, him a massage. Go and give him a massage. You just suited a mullet. Jamie O'Hara, chef, uh, Chesterfield. Yeah, I mean, they're hard to find because, you know, like, there's been so many other big teams in front of them. Yeah. Up cup finals and everything. It's hard to find pictures. Oh, wow. <gasps> what the f. Nah, mate. That ain't you. That's not bad. If you were my boy, I would never let you, let you leave the house. <laughs> I just lock you in a room, eh? What you you're like you've never seen sunlight in your life, mate. <laughs> <laughs> and casually in your hands. Slim and everything. That actually looks like you, Slim. Fuck yeah, I would have been. That actually looks like Slim. Fuck. Fuck, I've never been that fucking ugly. Doesn't look as good as me. No way. That was a bad haircut. And I went just full skinhead. You'd have looked good. felt harder after that. Do you know what I mean? That's the best picture, eh? You look, mate, you look a million dollars there. That's a bit of Ricky, mate, when I was fucking fat. How have you got an arse in your head? I mean, it's a fanny, innit? Do you know what I mean? Look, I need like filler or something. You, he's had Botox. Uh, he? he does. No, get facials. Uh, get facials. Will you get facials? Uh -huh. go, go like that. Go like that. No, I've not had Botox. Botox. I wouldn't do that, mate. Facial every day. What do you want to see Selene's hair at? Where would you say, Mother? See what you think, would you? <laughs> no, because my pictures are really bad back then. Oh, they? Would you say this is a good hairstyle? <laughs> Right, where was the one I was going to show you? Did you see that was a good hairstyle? <gasps> I mean, fuck me. Who gives birth to you? <laughs> Do you know what it looks like? You've just sat in front of your dad and you just farted and a wee bit. It's just like... <laughs> and he'd come out. <laughs> and I was like, by the way. He farted and you came out. <laughs> Get your one up, Simon. No, no, fucking hell. No, 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 get that one to look at his man. Be nice, see that. Right, right, stand out, Clover. No, get the one with... Uh, what was the what, one with... We say like, yeah, well, like he's, he's a good-looking boy, though, isn't he? Uh, he's got I a bit said, of style, isn't he? Like, I said to like, him, with the cannio and that, didn't he? Oh, I said, what about me and Paolo? Stand up, Clover. What do you think? This is his new kind of look. These... Oh, I like it, mate. You've like watched the game. I mean, you've gone very like London, though, haven't you? You is know, that, like, you've gone like city boy. You've gone city boy. Yeah, like businessman. You look like you know you earn more than fifty quid a week now. He doesn't. He doesn't have to say thirty-five. I like it. It's been an improvement. I mean, when I first come up here, I was like, who the fuck is this guy? He had a track your bottoms on. I loved you for it, but... You have a well, he's calling himself an entrepreneur now. Businessman entrepreneur. I'm into it. I'm getting you out. must be making some cash now, you boys, right? You'll be killing it. He is loaded, isn't it? I'm into it. He is, he is. He's got a new flat penthouse in Glasgow. Have you? It's amazing, mate. Yeah. What well, about uh, Calvert Loon? Is it too much? Uh, look, everyone's got their own vibe, haven't they? Do you know what I mean? Yeah. 
and I think the modern way now is just to express yourself with what you wear and I don't get it. I mean, I think he looks horrendous with what he's wearing. I mean, what is that gear? It's absolutely shocking. But people would say it's fashion and we're, and people would say we're old fashioned. But mm. I mean, for me, come on, you just keep it simple. Where, where do you stand on Noel Cavanley? Do you like it? Nah. Do you, you like it, do you? Uh, I think if, I'm, if that's how he wants to dress, then. No, I think if he wants to dress, he can dress like that. I just don't, just don't fuck me that. Yeah, yeah. Uh, who else? Uh, Daily Alley was mentioned. He's getting all like serious, serious isn't he? Like, like, <laughs> don't like joking about that. You know what I'm saying? We've got no banter no more. Do you want me to come up and take over and go with you, Swain? You want to fucking take it to a new level, right? Like, new fucking heights. Where do, where do you think you could take him go? That we've not already. Worldwide, mate. International. You think? Yeah. Fucking hell. Because no one's heard of you in by the airport. <laughs> so you must just be round here. Like the Barras. What's it? The Barras. The Barras. Everyone's heard of you round here. The airport. No one's heard of you. <laughs> what about uh, Kate, uh, Calvin Phillips shoes? They were shockers, man. Look, ones were they again? Like puffy fucking things. No, they were, sh they were horrendous. Yeah. Oh, what is he wearing? Horrendous. I mean, who, 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 who dresses these people? No. Who's got, who do you has got a bit decent cobber? Grealish? He likes the old... Ah, Grealish is good, he? No, I mean, it just looks like he's been puked up on by Gucci, doesn't he? Yeah. Is he, is he a Gucci deal now? Because he's like sponsored by Gucci. I know, like, I love that. Fuck, yeah, Who's it you're sponsored by? Dorothy Perkins. Dorothy Perkins got me. Matt, Matt, Matt Allen. Matt, Matt Allen. Allen. Aldi. Matt, Aldi. Aldi and Matt Allen are fighting for me. Yeah, he's got a big sponsorship. <laughs> Lidl. He's not Lidl. He's not fighting for us. Lidl. Uh, right, we're going to now. Harris biggest rant. You love his rants, don't you? What's your favourite one? Aye, no. I was a cracker. I've had a few. No, what's your favourite ones that he's done? He, he ain't got a fucking clue, has he? He ain't got a clue. <laughs> what, what is your biggest rant? Um, oh, you went on Sky right. Sports News. You made an RC sell with Bournemouth and Rangers. That was you must now see that you've ha you had an absolute shocker with that. <sighs> Come on, be the bigger man. Yeah, I had a bit of a beast there, yeah. but you know what it was? I got my words mixed up because I'll, sta I'll stand by this. And it, Rangers have done unbelievable this season. Fair play to them, but it's still a better job because Bournemouth are now in the Premier League, so they are amongst the elite football clubs again. No, Rangers are amongst the elite football clubs in the Europa League. In the Europa League. League, yeah, but they've got to win it. If they don't win it, then what up there well, in the so Europa League again? Celtic will be in the Champions League next year, group stages. Yeah, Celtic will never get anywhere near that. Yeah, that's great. So would you rather manage in the Premier League or the Champions League? Yeah, but how many times are you going to get in the Champions League? Well, if you win the league now every year. It's guaranteed, yeah. Yeah, I mean, yeah. yeah but are Rangers going to win it every year? Mm. They've got to fight for it, right? Every yeah. season. Bournemouth in the Premier League. Yeah, no, I made an ass of myself. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's true. Really That's why I love you for, mate. You can, you can admit case. your mistakes, haven't Yeah, you? I fucked up. Uh, what, what other ones have you had this season? So you've had I mean, the Spurs one. The Spurs, Spurs one, right? The lads, I, I got some sticks Did for you? this. Did you? Yeah. Have boys? So, yeah. You I, went full Scott Parker, didn't I went, you? I went, I went in on them. We got beat by NS Moore, didn't I? I was on Sky. Did you regret it? I regret naming names. Did you, did you get a bit, a bit back I went. I, I, I named names and I named one of my pals as well, Doherty, who was a mate of mine. I'd just played golf with him the week before. No way. And he, had, and he was having a tough time. And I dug four or five of them out saying they should never wear a Spurs shirt again. And I really went in. I mean, we got beat by fucking Moura. You know, that was embarrassing. It's like getting beat by fucking Broomhill. <laughs> Yeah. Boomil, can you call him Boomil? Boomil, got beat by Boomil. Right. So did he, did he get it for you? Yeah. Fucking boom ball. Did he? <laughs> so he, yeah, so I dug him out and it went everywhere. And I had the press manager phone me, like from Spurs, who's a oh, mate no. of mine, who was like, look, you're out of order, the players are not happy. They're sat in the, in the dining room, because everyone has it on, right, in the training grounds. Sky Sports News is on, I'm there hammering them. And he said, the players are fucking raging about it. They want you to come down. I was like, nah, nah, I'm not coming down. There's no way I'm coming down. Was your heart sinking? you? Yeah. Were you shitting yourself? You know, I was, I was shitting one a little bit because yeah, like, it's yeah. my team, isn't it? You know? And I was like, like Hugo Lloris was fucking raging. But Doherty, I felt, I felt bad because he was my mate. And I dug him out and said he's been shite, basically. And, and, and he, he, I messaged him. He didn't speak to me, and uh, it took a while. And then when it, it finally, I messaged. We started playing well, and I messaged him again. He said, "Look, mate, want to message you? You know, like obviously you, you've picked up. You're doing well. I was out of line. I, you know, I was on TV. Russia blood. I shouldn't yeah. have said what, what I said." And he was like, "No, you're a prick." Did he? Yeah. You spoke to him since. No? Yeah, and then and he come round afterwards. He said, "You was out of order. I expected more from you." You don't realise, do you? Yeah. Like. <clears throat> You don't realise they watch us. Like they watch, they'll watch the Open Goal podcast. You know, like they'll watch you on TV. So, but you and, need to be honest, man. Yeah, I've got to be honest. I get paid to be honest, yeah, right? Yeah. So we've got to give an honest opinion. And I was right in what I was saying, but I just went a little bit OTT with it. And 
I think as players, you've got to kind of, we've been players and we know it's horrible and it's not a nice, you know when you've been shit. Yeah. So would you not name names again? Oh no, I absolutely would. You would? Yeah, yeah, if they're not good enough and not pulling their weight, then you've got to, right? Because otherwise, what's the point? See, Is when you've done it, did your phone explode? Like, yeah. like, see when you're sitting, oh. so if you did, I don't well, know. See when you Twitter, say something, like, and your phone starts. I was, starts, I was like, trending oh, no, on Twitter, and it's said, just like, if you're trending on Twitter, it's just ne it's never a good thing, is nah. it? Right? It's never a good no. thing. So, do you read all the comments on Twitter? Right? Do you read every comment on Twitter? No, who gives a shit? Do you know what I mean? I don't care. Just say what it is. Yeah. yeah. Say it is, and if you, if you get it wrong, then you hold your hands up and say you got it wrong. This yeah. is a player. Do, surely they're. No, they get it. I think he got it in the end, but it's just not nice. You've been a player, right? You've took shit. Mm. You've played shit, you know, 95% of the time. <laughs> so you know what it's like to take stick. You know, me and Si, obviously, only 5% of the time yeah. we were shit. You've got to get your tongue at his ass. <laughs> Gaffer now, and I want a job. Yeah, yeah you gaff. Right, what are we doing? Are we moving on? Right, Come we're on. nearly done. Slaney's best moment. We've we're done, best we're moment done the head shave. What um, else? What else? I'd say that. I see. I would say seriously, that was your best moment of the season. What the head shave? No, no, the picture. No, the, 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 the Grosvenor picture. That, that, the the, 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 the day you got that cleaning there. job in Grosvenor. That'll be the best ever. Right. So come on, the hydro when you first sold it out. I mean, that, that was the best. Must have been an unbelievable feeling. Like that's that's fucking no small feat to do that. Incredible. Nah, it's just normal for us, isn't oh. it? Expected, mate. Is it expected now up here? He was, were you shitting yourself before we went on? Was you shitting one when you go on, or was you fucking buzzing? No, I was shitting myself. Was you? Aye. We were all bad, weren't we? Like, have you ever done any live shows like yeah. 500 people in Sex show, that? Yeah, but I mean, what was it? How many do you have? 12,000 12, or something? 000. It's unbelievable, lads. You just don't do any live shows? Yeah, well, you know, you get a man and his dog turn up and you just <laughs> chat shit. 12,000 people, people turn up uh, for a podcast. See when that guy really? goes a minute to go, mate, that is never felt anything like it in my life. Eh? Really? Oh, we need to do a rehearsal, God, but see the last time we've done it, the rehearsal didn't... That never went well either. Oh, what, you've done a rehearsal? You never went well. Only day, a few hours before the fans came in. Yeah, yeah. But the... The sound wasn't working. Who's the star of the show? Slightly the star of the no, show. No, no. Oh, he's, he? uh, he's good, mate. Because you come out and get the charge bigger. Charles McGrew? Charles McGrew? Yeah, the black yeah, one. Yeah, yeah, he, yeah, he's yeah. amazing. He's, he's a big boy as well, soon isn't he? Big handsome, was on it. James Soonis was on. And what was it you seen him doing in his dressing room? No, he needs to stop that, Soonis. What? Oh, can't get into that. No, go no. tell him. No, I can't hear him. Tell him what Soonis was doing in his dressing room. He needs to wrap it. Because you're not getting invited back. It is what? The stuff he was getting up to after that soon. Get that out. Have you was there? <laughs> oh, of course he was. Oh, of course, course Decanio was there. <laughs> in spirit. <laughs> in spirit, was he? Did he have a big picture up next to him, just framed? Me and Paolo just stood there with his arm round him for the whole fucking podcast. Mate, he had a kilt on, but what he didn't realise is that the hydro there's big screens, so he's like jumping about, telling stories, mate, and he's full cock and balls just swinging about. <laughs> didn't ever see it on the big screen. <laughs> didn't he have a clue, man? <laughs> uh, right, Hornets player of the season, previous winner, Paul Slane. It's got to be you every season, no, Who is it? Who Hodgson, is it? Hodgson, you've said Hodgson, Roy Hodgson. Roy Hodgson, would you give him it? What do you mean? The the horny. Horny. Well, horny. I mean, well, where, where are we going with this? Horny. <laughs> I'm trying horny to think guy. of a horny gaffer. Dean Smith looks horny. Mm, I don't think so. <laughs> nah. nah. Just gives nah. him these books, doesn't he? Just what? These books when he goes Horny in gaffer. He's I mean, Daniel on. Farker. Oh, he's a, he's a porn director, yeah. isn't he? Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, he, 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 he looks like he could, you know, he could come up here and just, you know, do business. Yeah. McCoy's. McCoy used to be horny. Back in the day, wasn't he? Yeah, yeah, back yeah. in the day. He was a boy. Is he the best in Talk Spot? Uh, yeah. Who did you enjoy working with this? Him? Ali, yeah. Ali, Laura. Yeah. Yeah, Ali's unbelievable, wasn't he? Mm -hmm. He's a legend. Right, yeah, open go highlights. We've got 100,000 subscribers. You've got 100,000 on YouTube? Yes, mate. So you're not Jake Paul yet? Oh, what's he got? He's a freak, isn't he? Hundreds of mate, fucking fair play to you boys. It's a shame you're not making any money out of it. What are you fucking guys playing? Uh, what uh, how many have you got? You got a YouTube channel there? Nah, what the fuck is YouTube? <laughs> YouTube. <laughs> Come on, mate, I'm old school. Radio. So what's, what's your highlight of the season then? Then talk spot. Highlight of the season. Personally. A personal highlight for me. It's a good fucking question. Um Personal highlight for me would probably, I mean, I mean, yeah, probably getting sports bar, being offered sports bar. To, to be from where I've come from, the background that I've had, the fucking shit that I've gone through, you know, to absolutely fall apart as a person, to come back, build yourself up again, a bit like you, right? You know what I mean? Same, you know, same thing. We built yourself back up to be respected in the game. People like you. And then to get offered your own show to take on a huge show in London, which is, you know, that's. Brilliant, Matt. Do you know what I mean? Oh, that's that's okay. We're proud of you, innit? Yeah. We actually we stick up for you all the time, mate. Thanks, Seriously, mate. didn't we? It's a shame. Well I don't do the same for you. So. <laughs> <laughs> You've done great. You've done great with you, man. 
I absolutely love coming up and seeing you. Are we, are we, are we, is this a continuation or is he fucking us off now? I to think be he's got it. He's going to he's he's gonna now host the podcast. Is he? Yeah, so he's, he's fucked off fucked to Boom Hill. Lifters. So he's playing fucking Boom, boom Hill ball <laughs> with Cy <Si> Ferry. <laughs> <laughs> you got to be signing that in Fenmore, haven't you? No, no. Big name. acne up top. All ball players, mate. Everyone's a ball player. Oh, you're oh, fucked, mate. You, you're player. in for a quick fucking education in Mum League, mate. You are in for a quick I'll education. I'll scoosh it, mate. Don't you pitch. worry about me. Well, you've got you a decent are, pitch. You, yes, good pitch. Is it? Is yes, it, is it yeah, a decent pitch? Exactly. pitch. You've got Astro. Oh, yeah, you might be right. Very in a fine detail, mate. Everyone's Everyone's no stones on top. Have you got any fans? Listen, you've been sacked, so you don't tell me. No, I've oh, oh, been oh, oh, First five games of the season, I'm going to be there, mate. And listen, that see, fucking boom pill scarf. See if you continue, we'll sack you. We'll get Grover there to sack you as well. So just be on your best. <laughs> <laughs> right. Ah, what a show, boys.